Chester Visual Arts is a charity and it was established to look at arts provision in Chester and provide new impetus to it, a fresh injection, with the intention of establishing a support structure for the visual arts in Chester. So the Woman's Hour Craft Prize is an exhibition from the V&A in London. It aimed at looking at celebrating craft and the best in contemporary craft. 1,500 professional makers apply to the open call and the exhibition itself features the 12 finalists. So it opened at the V&A in 2017 and it's toured around the UK since. So we're absolutely delighted to bring it to Chester. One of the best questions that keeps emerging from visitors in the exhibition is what is craft? It reflects the diversity of the works on display. Laura Ellen Bacon's large willow sculptures that she makes site specifically in exhibition spaces, all the way through to um, different traditional crafts and different uh, traditional materials as well. So all the pieces together, while they stand separate, they do represent the diversity of contemporary craft. Well, the v &A is a world leading institution. For Chester, bringing v &A exhibitions, it's a sign of quality. You know you're going to get the best in artists and makers, but also in exhibition, exhibition design, the whole process. And what we're doing is we're bringing world leading art to the city, and that can only be a good thing. I work as gallery manager, so I'm front of house managing the volunteers, but also speaking to people that come into the gallery each day. And everyone says how needed it is and how it's so surprising that Chester, um, given sort of its heritage and the building, that it doesn't have a space dedicated for visual arts and craft. You've got the beautiful cathedral, you've got the town hall. Story House has made an excellent cultural impact as well but there's nowhere for art. The city itself, um, it has really beautiful buildings, it has a lot of tourism, a lot of people come to visit Chester, so I think it makes sense for there to be a space that houses contemporary craft and contemporary art. If things are very fleeting or moving or not permanent, it it's hard to get any momentum, whereas I think if it becomes a permanent space, it allows for more things to happen, workshops to happen, a wider conversation, more organisations to get involved. Chester Visual Arts um, it wishes to bring high quality exhibitions to the city, but also to really provide the infrastructure for artists to make art in Chester. It's adding another dimension to that cultural offer for the city, but it's also bringing to the fore all the people with passion for art in the city, they're giving them an outlet and a platform, somewhere where we can unite and celebrate contemporary art.